Alrighty guys, welcome back. Um, I'm just trying to get a whole bunch of these out of the way so I have some content and not have to worry about um, content uploading for the next couple weeks. So yeah, um, this is another sketchbook tour as you may have guessed from the title. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is sketchbook number five from August 2016 to January 2017. Um, the reason why this one took so long, no, I lied. That's number six and number seven. I have no excuse for why this one took so long. I just, I just wasn't in the mood to draw, I guess. Um, yeah. So, let's get started. Okay, there's nothing on the back. A five-minute doodle of, warm-up doodle of some houses and stuff. I was trying to get perspective, but I suck at perspective, guys. Um, my OC, Rye Brooks, I actually had an idea for him coming back from New Jersey because we had gone to Six Flags Great Adventure, and I saw the sign that said Rye Brook, and I was like, oh my god, that would make a great name for an OC. So on the way home of our six-hour drive, I thought up this character. Um, so yeah, he's my little cinnamon bun, and he's a fashion designer. It's so all about that fashion life, although his parents want him to become a doctor, so he has to study medicine. But he, he secretly likes to draw. Don't tell anyone, guys. Um, this was a per birthday present for my friend Lou. I used my gold gel pen, and it's um, the ASL crew, um, Ace, Luffy, and Sabu, or Sabu, however you say it. I always want to say Sabu, but it's, um, it's Sabu, I think. Um, here's Rai again, do little chibis of him, he really loves pandas, um, yep, sorry, that's got some info on it. Um, prompts for 30 day OC stuff, I always try to do this and I never, ever, ever, ever get past like the fifth day, or even the first day sometimes, just like, nope. Um, this is when Kyo still had purple hair, um, 1950s concept version of him. I saw this really cute outfit, and I was like, I gotta draw Kyo in this. It was just too adorable not to. Um, here is Kyo in an epic AU that me and my friend did for a little while. Haven't really progressed with it. But Kyo is an artist, and he moves into a old house that he got really dirt cheap because it was surrounded by woods and forests, and nobody else wanted to live there. So he just got it. Um, blank pages? I guess so, blank pages. Um, I tried to do a Polaroid of Yaloise and Kyo, but it didn't work out. I, My dog or my dad or somebody like bumped me and nope, didn't work out. Fluffy kitty. Kyo and Yaloise again. I was trying to decide like what I really wanted him to wear. Um, yeah, it's a good one of him, but he doesn't really look like that. I, I'm not consistent with how my characters look. Um, this is one of the, it was a little bit after I first got my brush markers. Um, so it was me just trying to figure out how they worked. And see, like, it really bleeds through, like, onto the next page. So these aren't very good for for markers. Even though it comes on really nice. Like, I like how it layers. Um, OC for a friend that I was designing for her. Um, it was a fish man. And he really came out really cute. I really like him. His little design is really cute. Just some vent art. I was really mad. And I just couldn't draw. I was in an art block. Um, Akira and a tapioca from, I think it's Sudorima or something like that, Suritama or something. It's a fishing anime with aliens, and the style is really, really cute, and the opening song is really catchy along with the, um, the dance that they do. So cute. I love that anime. I've watched it twice. It's so cute. Um, pen doodle that I did at work that I, later I colored in at home. Um, I like how this one came out. 
um, pen doodle. I tried to color it in and it just did not work. I messed up her face and I'm really disappointed because she was really pretty. Um, some doodles for Kent's hair. I was just doing some thumbnails of how I wanted his hair. Um, this was, it's not the finalized design. He doesn't look anything like this anymore. Um, he's still super flirty though. He's a, he's a brat. Um, Aki, my OC Aki as a teenager. I did this with settler colored pencils. That's why the coloring is so light. I just don't like hard lead pencils, guys. Like, they're high quality, certainly, but I just, I don't like them. This is NSFU stuff that I'm not going to show you because I know what those thumbnails are. Um, this was thumbnail for something I was going to do. And I started this one, never finished it. Um, Mika, again, uh, he looks really childish in these, and I just, I can't, I don't like looking at him. It's a little painful. Chibi's cute, though. That's what he looks like without his hat. Although, since I didn't really know how to draw his hairstyle back then, I probably reworked that. Thumbnails, um, I actually did a painting of this. I don't know where the painting is. Oh, it's downstairs. I lied. So I do know where it is. Um, if you guys want to see what it looked like, um, check out my Instagram at, uh, Suke Doodles. Um, I think that the info is going to be in the description box. So if you guys just want to check that out. Um, I got some Spectrum Noir markers for my birthday from my parents. They came home and was like, happy birthday. And I said, it's not quite my birthday yet, but thank you. Um, so I was really happy with those. I was just color swatching to see how they did on this paper. And I really like this brown. Like, I use this brown a lot in a lot of stuff that I color. Um, a friend's OC. I was just seeing how I drew her. Um, I think that she is Aoi Chan's, or Aoi. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm sorry. It's like A-O-I. So, I want to say Aoi. Or, o I don't know. I'm not going to butcher it anymore. Anyway... It's her OC. <laughs> um, Mide. She's so cute. I really like her design. I really like her dress. It was fun coloring, like, the, the ribbons and stuff on her dress. And her face is just so cute. Um, this was a present for her. Um, this was with my OC Kale. Uh, it was a Valentine's Day thing. I actually drew this in my toned sketchbook. Um, hold on. Let me see if it's right up front. It's right there. Um, I kind of just wanted them and I drew that for her. And he's so cute. I really like his design and her design is so cute too. Um, yeah. So I drew that as a surprise gift for her for our collaboration, which is right here on this page. Um, and I ended up going with this one and I honestly don't know where the line art for that went. It's somewhere in one of my sketchbooks. Um, yeah, it's in my computer somewhere. I have it saved on my computer. Um, this is based off of two stuffed animals that I have. I wanted to give them like 60s vibes. Um, Pippin's kind of more like the easygoing kind of guy and Bambi is, um, very like well off and her family's like, oh, you gotta be, you know, like the part, play the part, that kind of thing. Um, art trade with Small Bean on Drawing Amino. Um, they wanted some Danny Phantom, um, slash OC fan art. So, I was just doing out some thumbnails. I don't know what the hell that is. It's not her OC, but, or their OC, I mean. Um, and that's what it was. That's what I came out with. Um, this was... A, um, these were thumbnails for a picture that I ended up doing. Um, it's on my Instagram as well and on my Drawing Amino account if you guys want to check that out. Um, it's a suke on Drawing Amino and it's a suke doodles on Instagram. So, yeah. I just wanted to not have you guys, like, searching for that. Uh, and then this was just a dream that I had and I was like, these would make some pretty damn cool OCs. And this was, like, the villains, like, henchmen. Like, their mask. It's like a gas mask. 
it was really cool. It's like based off a video game. I think I had watched too much SAO and Overlord. <laughs> and I had this dream. Um, a redraw that I did of a piece. It is on my Instagram. If you guys want to check that out. Um, came out really well. I really like it. I used all my Spectrum Noir markers, my red set. Um, these were all the ones that it came with, except I used a colored pencil for her skin. Um, thumbnail for a Valentine's Day picture that I started and never finished. Um, I just didn't like how it came out. Um, Rowan, in a scene from an RP that we had done, he got gotten stabbed. That's why he's clutching his abdomen. Um, Ophelia, um, Kaylin and Aloise's daughter, Aki, and Chiro, or Chihiro, we call him Chiro, um, the second son. I did a meet the artist thing, then I got my hair cut. Um, just some random eyes, nice, I like how they came out. I was trying to do realism again, drew my sister, to cut off that part, it looks just like her. I messed up on the eye though. Um, Reese, I did a make a, it was like a challenge on Amino where you paired up with somebody and you did out 10 things and then you did a random generator and it gave you the, the attributes to draw and that's what I, I drew with all mine. Um, was just doing some abdomen practice. I copied this off of Pinterest. So yeah, they have some good ab tutorials on that. Um, Reese again, Reese again, and I think that's it. Um, and if you guys want to know what personality type I am, I am an F, I am an INFP uh, with an A slash T. So it means I'm pretty like easygoing and stuff like that. Um, here's just some things in the pockets. There's Teenage Keo being rebellious. He doesn't smoke anymore. I, he doesn't smoke at all. I just wanted to draw him with a cigarette because I thought that would be cool. Um, I got my skin tone marker, so I used a brush marker and, um, colored that in. My friend, this is Luca. I introduced him in the last, um, sketchbook, but this is more his personality. It's, like, very solemn. He's very shy and quiet. Um... He, oh my goodness, he looks so good in this finished piece. If you guys want to check it out, it's on my Instagram. Um, this is Rye. I messed up on the line art. I'll have to have my friend send a picture of it because I sent it to them. I sent, I kept the line art, the original line art, but I traced it and colored it in and sent it to them. It came out really nice. I'll have to have them send it to me so I can put a picture in. Um, yeah, I think that's it for this sketchbook, guys. So if... You guys want to check out my Instagram and drawing amino and stuff just to see like ran um my more recent art. Feel free to do that. So I hope that you guys had a fun time looking at this. I wasn't too annoying. Um and that you have a good day, stay safe, live a happy life and I'll see you next time guys. Bye.